Hello Stoke community, welcome to another Starbase UGC video tutorial. Uh, today we're going to do a walkthrough. Uh, we're going to create a mission together. It's not going to be a good mission. Um, it's not going to be a mission you'll want to play, but uh, it's going to hopefully be helpful to you because I'm going to go from a space map to a ground map. We're going to kill a few enemies. Um, we're going to scan a tree. And that'll be our mission. So I haven't done anything yet except put a walkthrough in the description. The first thing that I want to do is I want to go to the Maps tab. And I do this because I like to create the maps before I create the story for the maps. And it, it, it'll make sense the more I do it. So the first thing I want to do is create a space map. So here we are in space. Um, let's go... Let's do Imiga again. You must specify a map name, okay? Imiga space. Okay, and there is my space map. Now let's create a different map. Um, let's do a ground map. And let's do gateway ground. Label the map gateway ground. Now I'm going to go back to the space map, and what I like to do is just lay out my objectives all at once. So I know that I'm going to have to kill a Klingon, and then I'm going to have to beam to the planet. So let's put in the Klingon, or Klingons. Let's do just a fighter. Let's put the guy right there. Okay, now after I kill this guy, I'm going to want to beam down the planet, so let's put a place marker by the planet, and its default radius is 10, which is way too small, so let's change it to 1300. And you see, I don't know if you can see the oval, but it's a radius that goes right about through here. So that means once I'm done killing the Klingon, and my next objective is to beam down the planet, it will trigger the beam down once I hit the place marker. Okay, so that's all I'm going to do to my space map. I'm going to go down to the ground map, and it involved, what do we say, killing a Klingon and scanning a tree. So let's, let's put a group of Klingons down. Okay. And then let's put a tree. I'm going to search for tree. There's a large tree. That'll probably work. Put it right there. Alright, so now I've got the basics, the just the bare basics of my mission. Now let's go to the story tab. This first guy is the guy who gives the mission to you. So I'm not really going to mess around too much with costumes. I'll make it a Borg. And he needs to tell me, hey, you go to Imiga. Now, I want to put my first my first mission objective in, and we said the objective was to kill the Klingons, right? So I'm going to put the kill enemies, and the mission text is to kill Klingons. Waypoint don't, doesn't matter. Um, encounter, now I need to specify what Klingons to kill. So here, here here's my Imiga space, or I could choose the gateway ground. But since we want to kill the ones in space first, we'll choose the ones in space. Okay. Now I see what that did is because I specified a mission objective that took place in space, it's saying, okay, you're going from one place, which is the whole map, to another. And I don't want to leave from the whole map, 
I want to leave from the system. So let me see. It's in Sirius Sector, and it's the Imiga system. So I'm leaving from there. Um, do you want to enter, Captain? And then it's telling me, well, where do you want to spawn at? Well, I want to spawn at the spawn point one on the space map. Because I have two spawn points right now. Remember, I've had, I have a spawn on the ground and I have a spawn in space. So I need to specify um, there's the spawn in space. Map mission. I think that's the mission name of the map. Okay, then my first objective is to kill the Klingons. Um, I've. Have I specified? I need to specify, yeah, that's the Klingons I want to kill. Um, and I could add more Klingons, or I could go to the next objective. I'm going to go to the next objective, because after I kill the Klingons, I want to beam down to the planet. So I'm adding in my reach marker, which is, reach marker corresponds with the place marker. So I'll approach the planet, and I want to identify, yes, that's the place marker that I want. And when I'm done, I'll say beam down. Okay, so that should trigger a beam down to the planet. Now, the story tab doesn't know that until I add the next objective. And the next objective is going to be the to kill the Klingons on the ground. So I'll put in kill enemies. My task is kill Klingons, and I will pick the Klingons on the ground. Klingon squad. Okay. And again, that brings in a map transition. It's saying, where are you going from? Well, I'm going from the whole map, which is the whole space map. Um, my science officer tells me... Uh, You want to beam down? And I say yes. Then make sure that my spawn point is the spawn point on the ground. And then the map mission. Hmm. Oh, confused by this button. Map mission will say walk through again. We'll say walk through two just so we can distinguish it from the other one. Okay, so then the mission on the ground becomes kill the Klingons and make sure I picked the Klingons on the ground. Um, I could add more, but I won't. And then once I kill the Klingons, the mission is to scan the tree. So, scan the tree you want to pick the object, and here's Alpine Tree. It's the only object I've added to the map. And this will be the text. Do I want to interact with the tree? No, I want to scan the tree. And I'll play air guitar while I do it. Okay, and then my mission should be done. Um, just to add a little flavor, let's let's put in um, pop-up dialogue. Um, after I kill the Klingons, then let's go to bridge officers, and my away team science officer will say, "Scan the tree now." Okay, I think that's my mission. Let's uh, see what happens if we play it. And I got to go to Vol or I got to go to Imiga, 
and I'm at wolf359, so that's going to take a while. I'll edit this part out of the video. Okay, I'm almost at Imija. I wish I knew how to say this planet. Imija, Imiga, Imaga. Continue. Now, that's a text that I could edit to be like, enter my mission. Do you want to enter, Captain? Continue. And that's buggy. Okay, so my first objective, kill the Klingons. Okay, where are the Klingons? Where's the Klingons? They're the Klingons. Man, they're four ships. You know, I'm gonna save the demonstration of me um, fighting Klingons, and I'm just gonna kill them. Die. All right, I killed the Klingons. And I did that with this kill target button. That that allows you to play test your maps without having to do the same combat over and over. Okay, now if this place marker works right, I should and it doesn't always work right. Should give me a prompt. There we go. Do you want to beam down? Yes. Who do you want to take? Security. Okay, kill the Klingons. Alright, where are the Klingons? There they are. Well, they're just standing there. Oh, okay. Kill them. Kill them. Scan the tree now. There's the tree. And there we go. I just completed my mission. I hope that helps people understand how to transition from one map to another. Um, please leave requests for future tutorials. Thanks.